L.A. Rider is brought to you by Dudley DeBosier Injury Lawyers, serving Louisiana motorcyclists and their families for nearly two decades. A motorcycle seems pretty simple. It has one engine, two wheels, and plenty of attitude. But you crash one of these babies, and things get complicated quick. That's when you need to call these guys. At Dudley DeBosier, we keep it simple. When the insurance company tries to pay you less, we fight to get you more. No hassle, no confusing legal terms, and no fee unless we get money for you. Keep it simple. Call Dudley DeBosier. Motorcycle crash, man Dudley DeBosier. 444-4444. Welcome to another great edition of L.A. Rider, Louisiana's only television program exclusively dedicated to motorcycle lifestyles, travel, and adventure. I'm T.W. Robinson, and we're so glad you're joining us today. This week, I continue my voyage up the Natchez Trace on my new street glide, Scarlet, with a stop in Tupelo, Mississippi, and a visit to the Neon Pig, where I find another pretty incredible hamburger. And then it's on to Clarksville, Tennessee, where Tammy Arinder and I discovered that girl power has a lot to do with the success of one of the state's oldest Harley-Davidson dealerships. While back in Baton Rouge, we check out Road Dog's second anniversary party and the annual burn run put on by the Brothers Keepers. All this coming up on this edition of L.A. Rider. So kickstands up, everyone. Let's take a ride. Welcome everyone. Well, as most of you know, I finally picked a name for my new ride and Scarlett and I spent some time together on the Natchez Trace. Well, no ride on the Trace is complete without spending a little time in Tupelo. And while in Tupelo, I find another great place to eat. Natchez Trace is a 444-mile two-lane which stretches between Natchez, Mississippi in the south to Nashville, Tennessee in the north. It's a beautiful roadway with beautiful vistas, tree-shaded canopies, and gentle sweeping twists and turns. Since no commercial vehicles are allowed, you don't have to contend with big trucks and heavy traffic. It's the kind of road that tempts a motorcyclist to roll on the throttle. But don't, the speed limit is 50 and it's heavily enforced by Parkway Police. Instead, just enjoy the ride. Spend a couple of days on the Parkway. Take in the view, breathe the clean country air, and stop along the way to visit some of the sites. Tupelo, Mississippi is just a little more than halfway between Natchez and Nashville and it's the perfect place to stop for the night. There's a lot to see and do in Tupelo, and of course, a lot of it has to do with Elvis Presley. It is the birthplace of the king. You can see his boyhood home, tour the museum about his life, and even go downtown and check out the hardware store where he got his first guitar. If you're hungry, there are dozens of great restaurants. On this trip up the Trace, I decided to check out the Neon Pig. I heard they had some pretty great burgers. And you know, I'm always up for a bigger burger. The Neon Pig is located in a strip mall on North Gloucester, pretty much the main drag in Tupelo. They have a number of burgers to choose from, including their Smash Burger, which was chosen best burger in America. There is also the Bash Burger, which is ground brisket, and a Crash Burger, 
which has both a smash patty and a bash patty. We ordered all three, with a side of fries, of course. <laughs> all right, just if I can uh, manage this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna need these. We're gonna use this whole roll of paper towels, I'm sure. Which side should I go for? Right here. Oh, okay. Which side should I go for? Right here. Oh my gosh, I'm about to pop. And I, I think you are too, Mike. Oh Mike. yeah, I couldn't do another, couldn't do another. I mean, we finished it all, didn't we? Because it was that good, wasn't it? It was too good, it was too good. Not yeah. good for this, but great food. Yeah, I had the smash and you had the crash. The crash. Yeah, and what about those fries? Heaven. I drive all the way here just for the fries. You too. Let's find a nice shady tree to take and go back. crash. <laughs> <laughs> Next time you're in Tupelo, be sure and check out the Neon Pig. I really think you'll like it. Stay with us. When we come back, Tammy and I meet the lady behind one of Tennessee's oldest Harley dealerships. And she is a real chrome cowgirl for sure. L.A. Rider is brought to you by the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign, a 501c3 nonprofit organization exclusively dedicated to promoting motorcycle awareness and rider safety throughout Louisiana and the nation. I didn't see him. She just came out of nowhere. Oh, God, what am I going to do? Watch for us. See us. 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 us. Nearly two-thirds of all motorcycle fatalities are caused by distracted and inattentive drivers. Please, watch for motorcycles. Motocross? We've got it at Gian Gonzalez in Baton Rouge. All the bikes, all the gear, and the expertise to help make you number one at the track. From beginner to expert, we've got just what you need at Gian Gonzalez in Baton Rouge. Come see us today at Gian Gonzalez, Louisiana's oldest family-owned power sports dealer. Located in downtown Baton Rouge in the shadow of the state capitol. Race on down to Gian Gonzalez. Becoming number one starts here. We're waiting for you! Want a high-quality used motorcycle delivered to your door with a money-back guarantee? At usedbikesdirect.com, you can choose from hundreds of high-quality American, Japanese, and European motorcycles. Just browse our website, pick your bike, get your financing, and arrange your trade-in, all from the comfort of your home. And we'll deliver it straight to your door for free, complete with a 30-day money-back guarantee. Buying a used motorcycle has never been easier or safer. Just go to usedbikesdirect.com and start shopping. For more than 40 years, Robert Rad Leonard has provided South Louisiana motorcyclists with all their needs, from a showroom jam-packed with all the latest gear to a full-service shop featuring skilled technicians who handle everything from routine service to complete engine rebuilds. Rad Cycles also carries a huge selection of pre-owned models and has the area's largest inventory of used bike parts. For all your riding needs, do what South Louisiana motorcyclists have been doing since 1978. Go Rad. Rad Cycles. They're rider recommended. For the best in restorative and cosmetic dental care, choose Dr. Jason Hutto. Your smile is important and so is your overall oral health. And at the dental office of Jason Hutto, our aim is to provide the highest quality dental care. From implants and cosmetic procedures to fillings, root canals, and cleaning, choose Dr. Jason Hutto. Hi, I'm Jason Hutto. Call for your appointment today. But not on Fridays. That's the day we ride. I didn't see him. She just came out of nowhere. Oh, 
are? What am I gonna do? Watch for us. See us. 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 us. Nearly two-thirds of all motorcycle fatalities are caused by distracted and inattentive drivers. Please, watch for motorcycles. Looking for a trailer? Check out Mike Gerald's Trailer Depot. At Mike's two Baton Rouge locations, you'll find a huge inventory of high-quality motorcycle trailers, boat trailers, cargo trailers, utility trailers, and custom-built trailers. Plus, the largest inventory of trailer parts and accessories in the area. Can't find that perfect trailer? Let Mike build one for you. Mike Gerald's Trailer Depot. Two locations in Baton Rouge to serve you. They're Rider Recommended. It's a glorious day for a ride in Middle Tennessee, and I've been begging TW to come to Nashville again. As you know, I split my time between Tennessee and my beloved home state of Louisiana. And as soon as she arrives, we head west of Nashville, then north to Clarksville. There's a couple of back roads to choose from. We decide to go through Ashland City and Highway 12. Once we get close to the Kentucky border, we see Fort Campbell, Kentucky, home of the 101st Airborne and the Screaming Eagles. This is one of the largest Army bases in the U.S. And this base is just a few miles from Appleton Harley-Davidson, one of the reasons I wanted to come here. I've heard so much about the owner, Tia Appleton Souter. My husband and I are both owners of the dealership. Um, my husband's not here, his name's Danny, but uh, it's hard. So uh, we went through four generations and our son is the fourth generation. Uh, my grandfather was, and his brother was the first ones to start it and then it went to my uncle and then my husband and I. So um, it's hard because we're in it for the passion. And so um, I might be chastised for that sentence, but um, we still love motorcycling. Like, that's why we're here. Tia says she considers it her privilege to serve those who serve our country. One of the most uh, hair-standing moments, and we have a lot of them, but one of the most was uh, one of the gentlemen. We have a lot of military that will come in here and sit, maybe because they're not with their family. Maybe they don't have a wife or children, so they will sit. And I noticed one gentleman that would sit, and so I just started calling him Milk Dud because he ate them all the time. So I thought, well, I'm at the dollar store. I'll pick up some and sling them to Milk Dud. And a, gen a gentleman said, you know who that man is, right? And I said, no, I think he's new to Fort Campbell. And he said, that's your block hawk down. He said, that's the one, he said, that flew. And so um, I confronted him, and uh, he's the epitome of a perfect man. I mean, and so many men are. We got so many great men in this in this town. And so um, he came to the dealership, and he said, "I have got a flag that was strapped to my body for my mother and father and for my son." And he said, and "They're vacuum packed, and I've been doing it ever since I started flying." When he returned home, his mother was no longer here took care of his father up until he was deceased and he gave the dealership the flag that belonged to his mother and it hangs in our dealership to this day and he told us every country that that flag has been through and he was the pilot that that movie was made about. Appleton goes the extra mile to take care of every customer but especially those who may be stationed at Fort Campbell and can't get home to their families during the holidays. It's with America's finest right here and so with that being said from generation to generation we're now in the fourth generation that we know that we've got to serve them and that is uh, something we don't even allow lunches on Saturday. We pay for every employee's lunch and then we all are here on the floor constantly so when they're not at work we're here to serve them and that's just something that we've done throughout all the years and on Christmas Eve the founding fathers were military unfortunately they're both gone now and they were fine men and um, at Christmas Eve there's not one employee that has ever griped, moaned, anything about it. We keep the doors open on Christmas Eve to feed the public. We roll the bikes out so every man and woman could have a Christmas dinner if they can't be home with their family. And it's just, it's amazing. So we've captured something that the rest of the world don't have. 
Tia also has worked closely with her best friend for many years, Novella. She was the first female salesperson and then became a motorcycle instructor. I had the opportunity to come and work for Appleton's as the first uh, female salesperson, which uh, I've been in sales prior, and uh, it was it was so exciting and, and something. It was probably like a dream. I was living a dream. But And then I, I did that for a bit, and then Tia said, hey, you know, and this is when the, uh, the Harley came up with the instructor program, and so uh, went through that, and uh, even though I kind of actually, believe it or not, thought, no, 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 and Tia said, oh, you, you are going to do it, and let me tell you, it was one of the most rewarding things I've ever done uh, probably in my life. Uh, I mean, I, I used to tell all the people that uh, asked me about should I take the course, I said, absolutely. It's like motorcycle camp here at Appleton's. I mean, you're, you're going to have... Retreat. You, it's yeah. a retreat. It's a retreat. You're going to have... Learning something. Uh, yeah. For sure. You're going to have so much fun. You're going to meet new friends and you're just going to have a fabulous weekend. Well, anytime you can hang out with these ladies, it's certainly going to be a ton of fun. But the best part is when you come to Appleton Harley Day Davidson in Clarksville and support them, you're supporting the brotherhood or sisterhood, whether it's our military or our motorcycle riding family. It would be so easy to sell this and allow a car industry to come in here because they're chomping at the bits to get us. But the gospel is, none of us are going to leave with our money. So if we all get a good life off of this girl right here, and we are able to pay the bill, and we provide for all the people that are working here, and then we get to serve those people on motorcycles with the respect they're due, then we're doing what we're supposed to. That's what a dealership should do that's Harley-Davidson. In Clarksville, I'm Tammy Orender for LA Rider. Thank you. It's so nice to meet you. Some girl power. Yeah, yeah, girl power, yes. We got girl power going on. Motorcycle power. L.A. Rider is brought to you by the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign, a 501c3 nonprofit organization exclusively dedicated to promoting motorcycle awareness and rider safety throughout Louisiana and the nation. I didn't see him. She just came out of nowhere. Oh, God, what are they going to do? Watch for us. See us. 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 Want a high quality used motorcycle delivered to your door with a money back guarantee? At usedbikesdirect.com you can choose from hundreds of high quality American, Japanese and European motorcycles. Just browse our website, pick your bike, get your financing, and arrange your trade-in. All from the comfort of your home. And we'll deliver it straight to your door for free. Complete with a 30-day money-back guarantee. Buying a used motorcycle has never been easier or safer. Just go to usedbikesdirect.com and start shopping. Motocross? We've got it at Gian Gonzalez in Baton Rouge. All the bikes, all the gear, and the expertise to help make you number one at the track. From beginner to expert, we've got just what you need at Gian Gonzalez in Baton Rouge. Come see us today at Gian Gonzalez, Louisiana's oldest family-owned power sports dealer. Located in downtown Baton Rouge in the shadow of the state capitol. Race on down to Gian Gonzalez. Becoming number one starts here. We're waiting for you! Support motorcycle safety and encourage other drivers to watch for motorcycles. Purchase a motorcycle awareness specialty plate for your car, truck, or motorcycle. For an additional $25 a year, you can help the motorcycle awareness campaign promote safety, awareness, and training programs throughout Louisiana. I'm T.W. Robinson. No matter what you ride, put a mat plate on it and help support motorcycle awareness wherever you go. For more than 40 years, Robert Rad Leonard has provided South Louisiana motorcyclists with all their needs, from a showroom jam-packed with all the latest gear to a full-service shop featuring skilled technicians who handle everything from routine service to complete engine rebuilds. Rad Cycles also carries a huge selection of pre-owned models and has the area's largest inventory of used bike parts. For all your riding needs, do what South Louisiana motorcyclists have been doing since 1978. Go Rad. Rad Cycles. They're rider recommended. I didn't see him. She just came out of nowhere. Oh God, what are they gonna do? Watch for us. See us. Watch for us. See us. 
Watch for us. See us. Watch for us. See us. Watch for us. Save us. Looking for a trailer? Check out Mike Gerald's Trailer Depot. At Mike's two Baton Rouge locations, you'll find a huge inventory of high-quality motorcycle trailers, boat trailers, cargo trailers, utility trailers, and custom-built trailers. Plus, the largest inventory of trailer parts and accessories in the area. Can't find that perfect trailer? Let Mike build one for you. Mike Gerald's Trailer Depot. Two locations in Baton Rouge to serve you. They're rider recommended. I'm T.W. Robinson, and we're here at the second annual Road Dog Custom Motorcycle Customer Appreciation Day and Bike Show. I'm just blessed that we made it two years. You know, people that have small businesses, you know what it's like. It's not easy, but if you do good work and you have good customers that trust you, it makes things a lot easier, and uh, this is our second annual. Uh, hopefully, there'll be a third, fourth, and God willing, a whole bunch after that. The Lord gave us the weather that we finally needed, because this summer, uh, it's kind of funny, my business kind of dropped off because it was just too hot to ride, you know? So anybody that's uh, thinking about sinning needs to realize that the Lord gave us a little taste of what hell's like, so I would behave if I were you. Then, uh, We've got some great food. Uh, I've had a lot of help from people to, to, to get this going. We've got Law Tigers here. We've got my little Fast Jacks racing team. Uh, got a, even got a trophy girl this year. So, yeah, we actually have two bike shows. We have that bike show, and then we have this bike show. <laughs> What's the difference? The difference is, this is all, these are not eligible because I built all of them. So that would be kind of suck if I gave myself the trophies, you know what I mean? But this is for my customers, you know what I mean, to show appreciation. And uh, we charge the minimal amount to enter your bike. Uh, the proceeds, if I actually make any money on this, um, are gonna go to Fast Jacks Racing, and uh, a portion's gonna go to Nation of Patriots. So it's all for a good cause. Okay, so Tony, tell me what this is, because I didn't recognize it. Well, it was a blast. The train and bikes, and when I was working at the Harley shop, these were for sale. So I bought two of them, gave one to my brother. I took this one and cut everything off from here back, rebuilt everything, made all of the frame pieces, put that 230 on the back. Uh, big bore kit, cams. Uh, ported the head out and put that SNS carburetor on there. It's got right around 60 horsepower up around there somewhere. After I started looking at it, I started thinking about fabrication and what I need to make on it. And that's when I decided to go ahead and I didn't want it to look like the blast. I wanted it to look like a, a small sports. I was getting bored. So this is what I came up with. I'm T.W. Robinson, and we're here at the Brothers Keepers 4th Annual Burn Run at the Gonzales Civic Center. What we do is we have this event, and uh, all the proceeds benefit Camp Catahoula, which is a pediatric burn camp. Um, basically, children that have been burned in fires or whatever, uh, when they go through Baton Rouge General's uh, pediatric burn unit, uh, we kind of team up with them 
and send these kids and, and you know, help them financially and send them to the, the, the camp. It's usually in July um, and they teach the kids, uh, they teach them uh, outdoor skills, they have uh, horse, horseback riding, uh, they also teach them, they do like uh, kitchen competitions, cooking competitions, because um, most kids, that, that's where they're burned at, is generally in the kitchen, uh, cooking accidents and things like that. Uh, so kind of getting these kids to do it safely and teach them that it's okay, uh, kind of conquer that fear, uh, let them go back out there and do that. car show, bike show, uh, we're having a scavenger hunt, bike ride, uh, we have some vendors set up, uh, kids games inside the Civic Center, uh, we'll have some jambalaya this evening and we'll also have a trunk or treat for, for the kids. We're, uh, we're a national, actually we're, we're, we have one chapter in uh, Australia um, and then we have chapters throughout the U.S. We hope you've enjoyed this edition of LA Rider and that you'll come back for more motorcycle riding and adventure next week. Until then, I'm T.W. Robinson. I haven't been everywhere, but it's on my list. See you again next week for another great edition of LA Rider. LA Rider is brought to you by Dudley DeBosier Injury Lawyers, serving Louisiana motorcyclists and their families for nearly two decades. Dudley DeBosier, official injury lawyers for the Motorcycle Awareness Campaign. When you get on a bike, you gotta watch out for gravel, potholes, and knucklehead drivers. But after a crash, here's what you gotta watch out for. Insurance adjusters, they can be tough on injured bikers. They may try to pin the blame on you, or pay less than you deserve. So if you've been injured, here's what you should do. Call the lawyers who look out for bikers. That's Dudley DeBosier. Motorcycle crash, demand different. Demand Dudley DeBosier. 444-4444. God bless Chrome Cowgirls. La, 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 la,